You are not worthy of that song, you little fruit loop eating bitch. Hello my loves, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jasmine and this is Melodic's World. Alright, so yes, we are back at it, honey. Okay, so last movie we watched was Candyman, right? 1992, classic Tony Todd, Virginia. Uh, girl, everything about that film truly is nostalgic, epic, cult classic, beautiful, artistic. I mean, just the list goes on, okay? Um, but today, you clicked it, we are going to get into some psychological horror that can be truly horrific for multiple reasons, right? Um, but nonetheless, <laughs> I think it's a movie everybody can enjoy, and it teaches you a little lesson underneath the surface, okay? So, we are getting into Jordan Peele's Get Out. So before we get started with this film, I do want to do a little housekeeping first. If you are new to my channel, hello, welcome. I hope that you'll stick around and smash that subscribe button. And if you haven't done so already, please make sure that your post notifications bell is turned on so that you don't miss any future uploads. Alright, so with all that out of the way, let's get into Get Out. Let the games begin. Girl, it is already, like, what are we doing here in the dark? <laughs> Fucking hedge maze out here. I think it's a left on, uh, what was that? Peacock. Oh, Lord, here we go. You're supposed to pay attention to your surroundings. Let this be a lesson, y'all. Pay attention to your surroundings. You don't just walk. Get out of there. No, this is when you run. Fuck this. I'm to go the other way. I can't. Oh my god. He has to be high. Because, honey. You know what I like to do, motherfuckers out here, man. Which is why you shouldn't be alone. Oh, Lord. Come on, bro. Yo, yo, yo. The cave. Sir. Not the drag. Girl, he's scuffing the kicks. That's crazy as hell. He should have known better. You know, I hate to say that because it's like nobody deserves for that to happen. And I'm not saying they do, you know, but you got to put that disclaimer out sometimes because you know. But, um, yeah, like, sorry, you shouldn't have. No. No. Oh, Lord. Are they saying run? Get me out. Get me out. See. Ah, let's get some real music. Now stay Ooh, yes. Come through, chocolate. Uh, he is so handsome. What's it going over there? I'm good. You got your toothbrush? Sure. Do you have your cozy clothes? Got that. Do you have your gun, your pepper spray, your baton? You need weapons of mass destruction. Okay. Whatever that means. Do they know I'm do they know I'm black? No. Should they? Yeah. <laughs> they should. Mom and Dad, my uh, my my black boyfriend will be coming up this weekend, and I just don't want you to be shocked. Hey, me like that, bitch. <laughs> so that was the first black guy you ever dated. Yeah. So what? Yeah. So what's his uncharted territory? Right. No one will get chased like that. He has a point. I'm just saying. First of all, my dad would have voted for Obama a third time if he could have. Should she suffer? Not the microaggressions. Girl! They are not racist. 
All right, clap if you think she should suffer. But you had to say that as a precursor. I wouldn't be bringing you home yeah. to them. Think about that for yeah. like two seconds. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You would if you was a killer. Don't Absolutely. let the killer get you. No, 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 no. You basically threw a dollar out the window. I agree with her with that. Kick the hat, oh, man. No vapes, no cigarettes, none of that. You can roll up a little bit if you want. Make sure it ain't skunky, though. How can I get in trouble for patting down an old lady? It's standard procedure. Terry just thinks of an elderly bitch as elderly. She can't hijack no motherfucking black. <laughs> oh, she can I'm hijack the plane, bitch. Right. right. She can be hiding the damn detonator in her sock and her boob and her, you know. How is Miss Rosie doing? She's good. She's driving. Can I talk to him? No. I like to talk to him, please. Hi, Rod. Okay. You know you picked the wrong guy, right? Oh, yeah. Of course I know that. This is all just a play to get to you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really proud. People are mad at you because you never take my advice. Like what? Like don't go to a white girl parent house. She doing licking your balls or something? And I, oh! Chris. Let me stop. Chris. It's Rod. Girl! <laughs> <Crap! laughs> that shit look like somebody threw that bitch. That didn't look like no animal just skidding along the road. Well, maybe it's gone. Oh, is it crying? Chris. I hate that. Damn, that thing is big. It didn't even look big when they were driving. It looked like somebody tossed that bitch and was like, <laughs> oh my gosh. So you guys uh, coming up from the city? Yeah. Yeah, my parents are from the Lake Monaco area. Sir, can I see your license, please? Wait, why? Yeah, just the ID. No, 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 he wasn't driving. I didn't ask who was driving, I asked to see his ID. What you doing, what you doing, what you doing, what you doing? Yeah, why? That doesn't make any sense. Here. No, 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 fuck that. You don't have to give him your ID because you haven't done anything wrong. Maybe baby is okay, cool. Anytime there is an incident, we have every right to That's ask. That's bullshit. No, you're right. <laughs> I don't believe every cop is bad, honey, but no, you're right. Okay? Uh, I'm good. That headlight fixed. And that mirror. But also the privilege. Thank because you. she can say that. If he was trying to do that or said he was, you know, sovereign or whatever you want to call it, girl, he would have been arrested. Okay? What? That was hot. Not that was hot. Don't encourage her. No, but uh, here we go. Oh, I'm kidding. You call me Dean and you're hungry, my man. How are you? Yeah, how are you? My mom, this is Chris. Nice to meet you. It could all be so simple, but you'd rather make it hard. <laughs> Girl, that's all I can think of. Because this would be seem so normal, right? Everybody's saying hi, we hug him. I want to give you a tour. They can just you, like go. unpack first. You want to unpack before the tour? It's such a privilege to be able to experience another person's culture. You're, you're going to love this. My, my dad's claim to fame was beat by Jesse Owens in the qualifying round for the Berlin Olympics in 1936. Those are the ones where... Owens won in front of him. My mother loved her kitchen, so we keep a piece of her in here. Georgina, this is Chris. This is Rosa's boyfriend. Hi. Hello. The uh, garbage goes under the sink. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. <laughs> I'm not going to say it. You're going to say it. I'm not going to say it. 
I know y'all say it. I, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. But why are they housekeeper stuff black? Sir. Come on, I get it. White family, black servants. It's a, and you say servants? We hired Georgina and Walter to help care for my parents. And they died. I, just, I, I couldn't bear to let them go. I mean, the boy. To, <laughs> I hate the way it looks. Yeah, because it looked hella racist. I, I would have voted for Obama for a third term. Oh, like Lord. A best president in my lifetime. Uh, my. Dad wasn't really in the picture. My mom passed away when I was like 11. Oh, I'm sorry. How did she die? Hit and run. That's awful. That yeah, is I'm awful. sorry to hear that. You were young. No, I, she, I don't remember a lot from that time. Well, that's okay. We don't have to talk about that. You smoke, Chris? Mm -hmm. You Jones a little bit already? Nervous huh? ticks. I'm quitting. Dad, this is why I don't bring people to the house now. That's okay, we're not judging. It's a nasty habit, though. You should have Missy take care of that for you. How? Hypnosis. Okay. She developed a method, and I'm telling you, it works like a charm. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Some people don't want strangers messing around in their house. Right. She puts me under once. The sight of a cigarette makes me want to vomit. Okay, fall back, team. It's a service we provide. Yeah, it's not a, right. I'm good. Cause it's not about that. It's it's really about I don't know y'all. Anything can happen under hypnosis, honey. You ain't putting me up there under no damn. It is. It is. Is it really? Yeah. That's yeah. Really we just kept it up because after after they died, we just it felt like we keep them close to us. Oh, I just wanted to have like a chill. Oh. Georgina, I'm so, I'm so sorry. Why don't you go lay down? Must be so very mm. Hi, dear bear. Hi, darling. Hi. This is the door around here. Hey, Rosie. Why would I lie? <laughs> huh? I love it. Did <laughs> <laughs> she tell you about her toenail clip? Oh, my God. Uh, what? Oh, my God. She used to bite them off, suck on them, and save them in the jewelry box. <laughs> Not bite them and suck on them. Girl, what you trying to get on a salt out of me? Count to 10, text my therapist, and try and have a great day. Girl, what is going on? I don't understand. Is she dipping in chocolate? Like, girl, what is going on? I'm going to go get dessert and Aunt Dean maybe clean it up. What the hell? So, Chris, what's your score? <laughs> what is that in the back? You and MMA fan. Dude, what? What? Hey, Jeremy, why don't we, uh... Let someone else have the floor for a second. You're dating my sister, right? What about it? Yeah, not nah, too brutal for me. <laughs> you ever get in a street fight as a kid? I did judo at the school, first grade. Aw. You should have seen me. Judo? With your frame and your genetic makeup. If you really pushed your body, and I mean really train, you know, no pussyfooting around, you'd be a fucking beast. Okay. Carrot cake. Ooh. Look at here, weirdo. Uh -oh. Carrot cake. This guy is nuts. Stand, stand, stand up. Jeremy. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. We just gonna keep taking it, taking it, taking it? No, 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 Right. I'm just gonna be Jeremy. The hell? I wasn't gonna hurt him. He was gonna put you in a fucking headlock. What is his problem? He's never treated any of my boyfriends that way. Ever, ever, ever. It's because he's black. Oh my god, and then my dad was a, my man stuff. My man, my man. I don't think he's ever heard that or said it, and now he's just. That's all he said. Yep. Oh, and my mom being rude to Jordan. None of this is new to him, girl. Crazy. <laughs> he lives this. Like, ugh. I mean, how are they different? I told you so. 
He did. <laughs> I don't know, after that one day, one introduction, and the, just everything, I don't know, I, I'd be getting the hell out of there. That noise, just everything about that is scary. Girl! Girl! Girl, he is really coming fast! Oh, girl! It's one thing when the white folks is acting crazy, but the black people's acting crazy too, bitch. We gotta go. Do you realize how dangerous smoking is? Oh. Wait a minute now, bitch. Yeah. Come in and sit with me, please. What are we doing? You wanna know how it works? No. You just dangle a pocket watch in front of people's faces, is that it? <laughs> you watch a lot of TV. <laughs> <laughs> we do use focal points sometimes to guide someone into a state of heightened suggestibility. Heightened suggestibility. That's right. That's right. Do you smoke in front of my daughter? I'm gonna quit, I promise. That's my kid. That is my kid. You understand? What about your mother? Wait, are we... Where were you when she died? Where was your mom? She, she was coming home. She wasn't home. Oh, what? Mm. Swallowed up. Have you ever been swallowed up? Oh, this bitch is sadistic. That is crazy as hell. Now you're in the sunken place. No, ma'am. Girl, we gotta go. I didn't get to meet you, actually, up close. I'm Chris. I know who you are. She is lovely, isn't she? Yes, yeah, she is. One of a kind. Top of the line. Real doggone keeper. <laughs> okay. Right. Hello? Hello? Something about that. Is you in there? Like, sir? <laughs> I should get back to work and mind my own business. You do that. You do that. <laughs> Something wrong with him. Something wrong with him. 
went off some air last night and I run into her and... Man, I can, I can barely remember anything. None of the thought of a cigarette makes me want to throw up. Like... Sounds terrible. I'm sorry. She don't seem that worried. I'm. Uh, <laughs> oh man. It begins. This is Nielsen and Elisa. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> so, how handsome is he? Okay. Oh. We really doing this bitch in the middle of a party? <sighs> okay. Is it true? Is it better? Wow. Fairer skin has been in favor for the past what, couple of hundreds of years. But now the pendulum is swung back. Black is in fashion. Run! <laughs> Run as fast as you can! Oh my god. <laughs> There's just too many sides. Too many. Good to see another brother around here. Yes. Of course it is. <laughs> yeah, you! Oh, hello. I'm Philomena, and, uh, and you are? Chris, Rose's boyfriend. Chris was just telling me how he felt much more comfortable with my being here. That's nice. I mean, he did. No, so you turned around and talked. Well, it was nice to meet you, Chris. <laughs> Goodbye. That sound is so final. Ignorance. Who? Oh. Jim Hudson. Chris. I know who you are. I am an admirer of your work. The characters in this film are so outrageous. 14 times before realizing I didn't have the eye. I began dealing. Then of so course you don't have the eye set. or the eyes. Okay, you don't have none of them. How dare you? I know. Life can be a sick joke. One day you're developing prints in the dark room. The next day you wake up in the dark. Oh. Genetic disease. One day later, it's slow. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> he didn't hear the sudden volume change. Like, it wasn't even a volume change. It was like the sudden mute, and now his phone's disconnected again? Sir, leave, get out. Come here, come here. What the fuck? Me out there. She unplugged my phone. Who? Georgina. I came here to talk to Rod and I got no shoes. So you think she did that because... Maybe she doesn't like the fact that I'm with you. It's a thing. So you are so sexy that people are just unplugging your phone? You know, the me. amount of gaslighting no, 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 this bitch is doing, don't. she's starting to get on my nerves, okay? Don't do that, don't. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, it's all good, right? Well, they got you on display now, huh? It's weird, man. Very weird. The person it doesn't work for. Yep, you in it. I got hypnotized last night. Nigga, get the fuck out of here. <sighs> Yo, 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 it's a quick smoke. Bruh, I don't care if the bitches are Yana Von Zant, okay? <laughs> she can't fix my motherfucking life. <laughs> I'm curing. It worked. Bruh, how you not scared of this, man? Right? But they could have made you do all types of stupid shit. They have you fucking barking like a dog. Flying around like I have it on video. Yo, know, it's the black people out here, too. It's like all in Mr. Movement. Because they probably hypnotized. Wait a minute now. Connecting the dots. Wait a minute. Okay. Wait a minute, because he really is connecting them dots. Hello. Whoa! Lord of my I owe you an apology. 
How rude of me to have touched your belongings without asking. I lifted your cellular phone to wipe down the dresser. And it accidentally came undone. Yeah, I... I Rather than meddle with it further, I left it that way. How foolish of me. And you still acting weird. All I know is sometimes, but if there's too many white people, I get nervous, you know? I do something. That's not my experience. Not at all. They treat us like family. Back up, bitch, because you're creeping me out. And some tell me your breath stink. <laughs> She's too close. This bitch is crazy. Right, right. I don't know what it's going to take, sir, but it's time for you to go. Chris, I want to introduce you uh, to some friends. This is uh, David and Marsha Wincott. Six and a half hours later. Too many names to remember, but hi. Right. Do you find the being African American as more advantage or disadvantage? It's a tough one. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. Hey. Yo, man. They were asking me about the African American experience. Maybe you could take this one. I find that the African-American experience for me has been... For the most part, very good. Although, I find it difficult to go into detail as I haven't had much desire to leave the house in a while. <laughs> <laughs> We've become such homebodies. Yes, yes, yes. But even when you go into the city, I've just had no interest. The chores have become my sanctuary. The chores become his sanctuary. Get out. Sorry, man. Get out! Yo! Yo! Chill, man. Get out! Chill, man. Chill, man. Get out! Get out of here! Seizures create anxiety, which can trigger aggression. No, 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 no. Flash. That's what set him off. No, 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 I know that I must have frightened you all quite a bit. Especially you, Chris. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll have to let you all get on the rest of the night without the aid of my marvelous wit. <laughs> <laughs> the whole ordeal has made me quite a bit exhausted. Why don't you just get some rest? My cousin's epileptic. That wasn't a seizure, right? My dad's a neurosurgeon. I mean, this is gonna sound weird, but... Just say it! When he came at me, it felt like a new one. Right, okay. Have you met Logan before? No, I don't know Logan. I knew the guy to come at me. Kids always think that tragedies that happen to their parents um, or people that they care about is, you know, is their fault. And it's so sad. So crazy. Even though this bitch is gaslighting the fuck out of him because... Mm. I'm not gonna leave here without you. I'm not gonna manage you again. Let's go home. This sucks. Good night, Chris. It's great to meet you. Girl. Hold on to your butts. Yo. That's Dre. Dre. 
Andre Hayward. He's a kicker with Veronica. Veronica. Yo, he's different. Right. Oh no shit. Why is he dressed like that? It's not that, it's everything. He came to the party with a white woman like 30 years old now. Sex slave! Oh shit! Chris, you gotta get the fuck up out of there, man. You in some eye-wide shut situation. Leave, motherfucker! Oh, damn! Help! Chris! Oh, oh shit. shit, his battery must be fucking died. Damn. Hey, man. Are you packing? Rose, we gotta go. We gotta go now. Girl, this is crazy. If only he listened. <sighs> so you weren't the first. Come on, sir. Connect the dots. Connect the dots. Gotta go. Okay, you ready? Oh, my lord. Yeah, just, just looking for my camera. Um, it's right here. Have you got the keys? I'm gonna put the, the bags in the trunk. Okay. Um, yeah, they are in here somewhere. Well, you can't find those keys? Hmm? No, I can never find them. Let's do this on more. Oh, the tension, bitch. The tension. Ooh, gotta go, gotta go. Rose. Rose, the keys! I'm lucky. Even the sun will die someday. But we are divine. I don't know where they are. Rose! Rose! Rose, give me those keys! Where are those keys, Rose? You know I can't give you the keys right there. Throw yourself out the window. Oh, shit. He's here. All right. Mind his head. This is so nuts. She got you, sir. No, ma'am. Maybe one day you'll enjoy being members of the family. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma Top flight security. You know all TSA issues should be brought up with your authorizing officer. Yes, ma'am, but, but this is not TSA business. Okay, don't call me ma'am. What about you not gonna get along? How can I help you? My boy Chris has been missing for two days. Your son is missing. Oh, no, 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 no. Not, not my son. My friend, 26. Look, Chris is supposed to come back on Sunday, right? And I've been watching his dog see it. That's it. So Chris sent this to me from his girl's friend's parents' house. See, that's Andre Hayward. Mm, you don't look so missing to me. That's because we found him. Right? But Chris says he's acting real different. Oh, Lord. Rod Williams. Oh, okay. I know, I know, I know, I know. Girl, Can we you know how this sounds, but you gotta listen! You know, you don't sound crazy. I believe they've been abducting black people, brainwashing them, making them work for them as sex slaves and shit. 
Hold on a second. Then he sent me some weird picture. I'm like, oh man, that's Andre Hayes where this dude been missing for six months, right? So I do all my research. They're probably abducting black people, brainwashing them, and making them slaves, or well, sex slaves, not just regular slaves, but sex slaves and shit. See, I don't know if it's the hypnosis, but all I know is they already got two brothers we know, and it could be a whole bunch of brothers they got already. What's the next move? <laughs> 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 That's a shame. Don't ever, ever say that I'll do nothing for you. <laughs> All right. Well, they were no help. Hello, Chris. Yo, um, hey, what? Rose, it's um, it's it's me, Rod. Hi. Where's Chris? He left two days ago. He left. Yeah, he, he got all paranoid and then he freaked out on me. And then he just got in a cab and left his phone. Look, look, oh, man, I, I've been calling this I phone can't work! Ma matter of fact, I went to the police. Let me ask you something. What cab company did he, uh, did he use to leave? Oh, gosh, I, I don't know. I guess uh, maybe a, a local one, or I guess he, he could have called an Uber. Okay, hold on. Lying bitch. She is lying like a motherfucker. I know that. That's gonna record your ass. Record the shit out of you. You talk too goddamn much. You gonna say something? So last time I talked to Chris, he told me your mama hypnotized him. Rod, just stop. I know why you're calling. Why is that? <laughs> it's kind of obvious, don't you think? That there's something between us? Oh, what you talking about, girl? I called you about Chris. Right. Whenever we go out, I remember you looking at me. What the no, fuck bitch. You know? This is my best friend. Hey, look, you give something to me. I know you think about fucking me, Rod. Ain't nobody thought about fucking you. Why would you say some stupid shit? What the? You can't fuck you. I didn't want to fuck you. Ah, she's so. She's a. She's a. Ah, she's a genius. If only he recorded the first part when she was acting sweet and innocent, and then the switch up, he might have had something. Hey, Chris. How's it going, buddy? Trust me, Jeremy's wrangling method sounds way less pleasant. Phase one was the hypnotism. That's how they sedate you. Phase two is, is this. So you won't be gone. And not completely. A sliver of you will still be in there somewhere. Limited consciousness. You'll be able to see and hear what your body is doing, but your existence will be as a passenger. black people people want to change some people want to be stronger faster cooler black is in fashion but don't please don't let me into that you know i could give a shit what what i want is deeper i want your eye man sir just pay for an eye transplant i'm sure you're paying for this procedure Go use that money and get you some new eyes. And this crazy ass brother. cranium in the head that took forever I guess the first part he took off the top skin and then the skull period bitch die 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 do it again keep up to the first stop don't stop till you get it now get ready now bitch cause that girl got you under hypnosis
Right, break that shit. Smack her. Hit her so dark, damn hard she goes to the sunken place. Oh, damn. Oh, he took that, bitch. She took it. Ooh. Yep, gotta go now. Die, die, die. What? See, this is why you keep hitting the killer. This is why you keep hitting the killer. Period. That was smart. That was smart. Right, Kurt stopped his head. Wait till it explodes like a watermelon. Die, die, die. You are not worthy of that song, you little fruit loop eating bitch. The symbolism, girl. She's drinking a whole white milk and a side of a bowl of Fruit Loops, colored Fruit Loops. My name is Chris. I'm sorry, sir. Can you repeat that? I mean, I mean, the only. I just realized that he was speaking in his accent. Run her ass over. No, 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 no. That's not your mom. You ruined my house! Oh Lord, I was just thinking where the grandpa at. <laughs> remember when he remember. Remember when he remember. Let me do it. Remember when he remember. I'm not I'm not come back, come back. <laughs> Chris, I'm so sorry. I, I love you. I love you. The way I would choke her out. I love you. Should she suffer? Clap if you think she should suffer. Girl, he ain't never gonna trust another woman again. He ain't, he ain't never, when I say damaged, his heart is damaged, damaged. He not that he should let you go. Oh, not the evil smile. Oh girl, it's not even worth it. That's what she wanted. It's not even worth it. Mother Ryan KSA! Top flight security, Craig! Oh, poor baby. I'm glad he didn't kill her though. At least not that way. Like, I know he wanted to, and ooh, did we want to see it. But I'm glad he didn't do it. I mean, I told you not to go in that house. <laughs> he did. He did. How you find me? I'm T.S. Mother A. Consider this situation. Handle. And that was Get Out, ladies and gentlemen. Round of applause! That movie did so much, I think, for a lot of different 
things in the culture, but also was palatable in a way I thought for white folks. I remember when I went to go see it in theaters when it first came out, premiere weekend, and it was mostly white folks in the theater. I don't know if it was like that across the nation or the world, but that just goes to show you, you know, if you just make a great film, you can have a lesson somewhere in there. I would love, the next time I watch it, I'm gonna watch it with someone who's never seen it because I wanna relive the first time that I saw it and how shocking it was, seriously. Uh, how, how much I always felt like the main character, you know? Like seeing the signs and just like, okay. <laughs> you know, just, uh, girl, the lives we live. Um, but thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this video's film. If you guys are new to the channel and you're still here, please smash that subscribe button, become a part of the family, and don't forget to turn on your post notifications bell so you don't miss any future uploads. All right, well, I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye. Cut the cameras. Dead ass.